The game was certainly not what we hoped. Um, they did what we expected. They came out and played hard, and they had four and five man rushes. And um, I thought our start was okay, and then we started turning the puck over. Uh, we stopped shooting it at the net. I mean, we didn't take our shots when we had that opportunity, and that allows them to turn over pucks. And I don't know how many teams are going to be faster on turnovers than that team. So there was a lot of pressure on our D, on our goalie. They hung in there and got us back uh, with the goal, make it two to one in the second. And for probably 10 minutes of that second period, I thought we were, we were right back in it, that we were forcing the issue. We were getting our shots. We still passed up too many. We had two on ones with no shot. And, you know, we have to realize that these are wonderful players that we're playing against. And when we simplify our game, we can play with them. We're good enough. And I believed in this team overall. I was you know, really pleased. It's just that as we got against the really top-notch teams, we tried to play them as if they were somebody else and not respect them enough and understand the details win. I know I say that every time, but it's details that win hockey games. and uh, They stick to the details straight to the point where they dump it in and chase it. And you know, we sometimes make lateral passes uh, that are hopers. And, Hope passes end up in a lot of trouble. Are you satisfied with the World Tournament? You made the quarterfinal, so maybe the main goal was accomplished? No, the main goal is always to win everything. And you know, we're thrilled to be in the quarterfinals. Um, we're thrilled to play, uh, have the opportunity to play against a team like Canada and, <clears throat> and show the world what we can do. You know, we expect, we hope for better results, but um, I would, as I said, I'm proud of the boys. Uh, they put a lot of effort into this. Some guys are quite banged up, but they kept playing. And, uh, you know, losing Pospisil was obviously a big loss for us because he was playing so well. But, you know, we don't make excuses. We gave it our best shot. And, Uh, if we just cut down on our little uh, funny plays, then I think we can play with anybody. And uh, we always look at winning everything, not just making uh, quarters. What do you think this uh, team was missing to make the semifinals? A lot of players say that maybe experiences. No, I think it was more just details. I mean, we when the pressure got on, we tried to make better plays. Uh, make a perfect pass, pass the puck until it goes in the net instead of shooting it. And certainly Kello's goal in the third period on the two on one, he just shot it and it went in. And we forget that shots on net often go in and if they don't, there's a rebound, something good can happen. So it's all about details for us. And, you know, we don't want to get in and and matches with them we want to get the puck keep the puck and shoot the puck coach what you can say about your future because olympic qualification is august well i guess i made an assumption that i would be there for that i haven't talked to meryl about it it's just uh, and i never make a decision on the emotions that I have right now. It's not a good time. You always regret them, wonder about them, try to change them sometimes. So I'm better off just saying that I'm proud of my boys and we'll talk, we'll talk about the future in the future.